Oh, wow, I'm enjoying this natural lighting. What a difference a window can make. Hello, everyone. Well, <laughs> wait, wait, uh, wait. I just licked my lipstick, like, right my as I just put it on. My lips are so dry right now. I hate the taste of lipstick. You know? Why did you just do that then? I didn't think about it. I was like, my lips are dry. But no, they're not. But I did it anyway. I like <laughs> Welcome back to my channel, or hi if you're new here. My name is Emma. I make videos. I post every Sunday at 8 o'clock. So if you're not subscribed to my channel, you should go down below and do that right now. I am here today with my beautiful, lovely, amazing best friend, Eden. And Eden, I don't know, do you want to talk a little bit about yourself or your channel or anything? Uh, yes. I do have a channel. Most of you guys probably won't like it, but you can go check it out. It's basically... <laughs> it's basically If you like DIYs or yes, anything. Not, not only DIYs, but I partner with a lot of people that create homemade different items from their own homes and try to help them get it out there. So right now I'm with partnering with a guy who does handmade pottery. That's and beautiful. yes, I have some videos about that and then also just like how-to videos, tutorial kind of mm -hmm. things. So go check that yes. out. She also has a couple of different Instagrams, so I will link them down below. So definitely go check that out. So today <laughs> Actually, let me give you a little bit of backstory. So yeah. this is my wonderful, beautiful, you know, amazing person, best friend ever. And we're going to be going on a trip in, when is it? March? May? In March. March. Thank May? You. I don't know, it's the M, the M, the M month. month. Anyway, so we're going to be going on a trip together and you're going to be seeing a lot more of her on my channel, like more than you've already seen. <laughs> so I figured you guys probably want to get to know her a little bit. So today we're going to be playing the... Who's more likely to challenge? And I made these cute little name card also, things. Also, Han Hannah. Emma? <clears throat> also, Emma put the colors as the hex codes we use for everything. So like this is one of the hex codes that's on my website. And this is her hex code. If you don't know what a hex, hex code is, Look which you should, <laughs> basically, it's, so you know how um, if you pick a specific color, sometimes it'll have like, the gradient next to it with all the different colors and there'll be a whole bunch of codes next to it. That's what a hex code is. So if you find a specific color in that gradient that you like, you can highlight that code yeah. and basically and put it into it. any website and it'll all of your colors will be consistent always. So yeah. this pretty blue color's mine. As you can see, it's like all over my website and my, or my, my website, my YouTube channel and my Instagram. And then this one's Eden's and yeah. it's a beautiful yellow color and they complement yeah. each other. Yeah. Wow. I actually have that. both of these, but this one's like more main, I guess. Sure. It's like this is an yeah. accent. Yeah. Anyway, so we're just gonna go ahead and get started. <clears throat> so number bear, one. Bear with me because I'm having oh. to look at this list. I'm sorry. But yes, number one. Who is more likely to live in a big city? What did you write me? Yes. Yeah. I didn't write anything, but I mean sure. what, did you, what did you pick? Emma. Me. I do love vacationing to cities. But I don't know if that's where I'm gonna be. Hmm. I feel like I have and 50-50 chance. Like you're done. I get that. I mean, yours is more like I'm going to live 30. I, that's exactly what I was thinking. Yeah. I think I'm probably going to live in a big city at some point in my life, it, whether it's just like in my young life or in my, you know, retirement <coughs> years or something. I don't know. I just I love the way big cities feel. Of course, we're going to New York together. We've gone to Nashville together. Yeah, we, I you know. yeah, exactly. I've lived I have my family's all in that area, so I've like grown, grown up, grown, mm -hmm. grown up, grown. Yeah, grown up with the city. So, yeah, yeah, I like it. So I would, I, I agree. Okay, next question. <coughs> that was cute. Woo! Whoop. Who is more likely to watch a romantic movie? Do you write you? Yes. Think about it. I don't know. I watch. Think about it though. The musicals count? No, though. <laughs> okay, then I pay, I I changed my mind. Because, okay, I'm thinking, like, every musical has some sort of a romance in it. So but, like, it specifically a romance romantic movie. movie. Okay, then find you. So, like, have you even, have you seen The Notebook? I've not even seen The Notebook. Oh, I've seen all of those kinds of things. Okay. And I read all those books, and I literally am way too obsessed. And I... I saw one... Is that Ooh. Stephen King? Is that the... The Notebook? Yeah. No. Who's Stephen King? Not The Notebook. <laughs> I don't believe you. Wait, my it's book. not. I swear. I'm pretty, that's like... No, The Notebook is by, um... The viewers are like, ah! I'm sorry, you guys are probably screaming at your devices. Right now, he I can't do it because I'm like, book. it's not Stephen King. It's a King. romance by not Stephen King. Nicholas Sparks, that's who I'm trying yeah, to Yeah, because he did The Longest Ride. Recommend okay. both the movie and the book yeah. is amazing. I don't remember. I went and saw something with 
that person one mm. time. And <laughs> wow. Matt Marlon. And it was garbage. I absolutely hate romantic things. See? That's why it's my... Okay. Yeah. So you there, there you go. Okay. <clears throat> Question three. Wow. Am I... Uh -huh. ah, that's I have water. Wow. That was enjoyable. I, have my butt. A, I No, I have a man's neck. I just like to point what that out. What does that even mean? Look at it. Me Do you too. see that? Me too, if I try. What the heck? Do you mean you feel like you have an Adam's apple? I feel like no, like the way that their neck like creates mine these lines. That. Okay, maybe I'm not, look at, but look at mine. <laughs> Anyways, sorry. <clears throat> <clears throat> Who's more likely to be best at math? Oh my gosh. You, 1,000%. <laughs> Guys, I was failing pre-calculus two weeks ago. School just ended yesterday, and I'm back up to a B, so. So, A, I, Way to go. I, I'm I making, I'm making straight A's in math. Straight A's. I also have to try extra hard, because math's not my strong suit, I so. just can't do it at all. I have to go in for, like, extra tutoring, and it takes me, like, six hours to do anything, compared to everybody else, who it takes them, like, 45 minutes to go through, like, the homework mm. sets or whatever. Yeah, I hate it. I, I, I Thank goodness that. I'm done with the ACT. I'm not. <laughs> Who is more likely to do weird things in public? Me, thousand percent. For sure. Yeah, you're a very composed person, so I feel like when we go out, like you're goofy and you're yourself, but you don't do like weird stuff. You would have been like, um, excuse me, you didn't put the lemon in at the right angle. Like that's yeah. something that you would do, and I'd be like, <laughs> okay, okay, yeah. No, I'm just kidding. I wouldn't. Care. No, but like I. But <laughs> But yeah, like even last night, so we went out to eat last night and so we got the cast list for our musical and I was like doing leaps in the parking lot, yeah, in the parking like, garage. Da -da, da -da. Insert clip. I mean, I'd be the one to like be very out in public, but I don't know. You're, I mean, you're still very goofy and wild and wild, no, very, born very to be wild. Insert that. No, I'm just kidding. Don't do that. I will not do that. <laughs> But that's more when you're like really comfortable with someone, I feel like, you know? Who's most likely to get in a fight? A physical fight. Physical altercation? Yes. I'm changing my answer. <laughs> because, okay, I think I'm, I get angrier than you, like quicker. Um, so I'd be more likely to yell at someone. You'd be more likely to say something that you didn't mean. Yeah, but I definitely, I it, don't think I, I can't throw hands. I but if it was a physical fight, see, look, I have part of my family from, like, Jersey in that area. Don't yeah. get me started. I'm a southern girl. I don't, I anyway. can't fight. I think I tried one time, and it did not end well for me, and it was with my sister. So, I was in fourth grade, maybe? Mm -hmm. We went to Tremont quick backstory and you should just say that that's like a summer camp the summer camp Tremont's a summer camp in the area I live in so the boys were in one room obviously for reasons we're in fourth grade and then anyway and then the girls were in the other room and the boys were playing like uh, ghost in the library which is like a hide-and-seek game and the girls were over there wrestling and guess who beat everyone me why because oh my gosh I show them your off why well okay you can't see them we, we arm wrestled last night, and I, I guess won. it won. Mm -hmm. I was close for my left arm. Yeah. But she still beat me. It was actually really funny. It was fun. I think you should zoom in every time I drink out of it and hear me going, <laughs> you get a bonus ASMR. Okay, who's more likely to invent something useful? 100%. Thank you. She's so innovative. I'm like, huh, this is going to be really hard for me. I don't, who's more pessimistic? I'm like, I can't do this for my, this is terrible. Everything sucks. I go to a STEM school. And we both like, do, heck no. I'm like, I got this. I have mind, creativity, brain, figure it out in this. But I, just I can't word say, sometimes. I would say I'm better at words. Yes. I'm good at writing and type, writing, <laughs> typing out my words or, you but know, But if it was like, who'd more likely to give a motivational speech? You, 100%. And that's why we work so well together. Yes. It's like Davy and Jack. Oh my gosh, hashtag Newsies. Nah, yes. Let's see how many times we mention Newsies. Count it in the bottom. I will. I think it's, is it been the first time? No. Who's, who's more likely not to take a shower for a week? Yes. I have to so hard. Okay. I used to be a person who took a shower every day, but then when I got my hair permed, also I curled it today, so that's why it doesn't look very permy. But when it's permed, you don't have to wash it as much. So I 
you know, won't wash my I hair have... for a couple days. I mean, I definitely have to take showers multiple times a week for like, you know, cleanliness. But like, if we're talking about hair, I could go probably a week. Yeah. I just need more dry shampoo. I have I... none. <laughs> See, need... there's nothing. Yeah. I need yeah. more. Oh Ready. Who's more likely to laugh at the wrong moment? Me. So we were doing a singer's thing, and it was a Star Spangled Banner. Oh my gosh. And for some reason, <laughs> I don't know why, I look over and Emma's like, <laughs> I lost my crap. Why? Okay, let me explain. So we were at the a baseball field to sing the national anthem, and we were standing in two rows, and I was on the front row because I'm shorter. Well, I'm not short, but like compared to the people in the group. Um, so I was in the front, and there's a microphone stand like this far from oh, my yeah. face and they didn't tighten the screw all the way and so we're singing oh say can you see and it's going down and my down and down and down and like by the end of the song it was like down by my feet i just like, like couldn't handle it she was dying we were like we were I all trying not so to laugh because we were laughing at her i mean there, it was, that's not even that funny but like it was no. such the wrong moment everyone's standing people hands over their heart like such a somber moment and i just couldn't oh keep my, my crap together but ah 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 this i know the answer who's more likely to forget important birthdays you forgot no you forgot your mom's birthday and aslan okay incorrect that is not incorrect. I, for like two, and your mom's anniversary for two no -uh. No, I, I know that one. That I just say good. I keep saying your mom as if she's just like <laughs> had the anniversary themselves. No, my, my father is here. No, but my um my mom's birthday for like two weeks leading up to it, I tried to remind myself every day that it was coming up. But then the day of, I had like twenty thousand things happening and everything, and we. But it's still a more important. Game. She gave birth to you. And then I forgot. I'm more likely to forget my phone somewhere. Okay, that's kind of where I thought you were gonna go with this. She loses her phone all the time. Like if you pull up my uh, find my iPhone thing, it's always hers. It's set up for me. Cause I'm like, I can't yeah. find my phone. It's cause I'm not attached yeah. to it like these other social media. Yes, videos. I understand. The other day I tried to, um, I lost mine and I asked Cade if I could use his phone and I pulled it up and my stuff was already in there from the last time I lost it. Oh my gosh. Like, the, sorry. I don't lose mine that often though. No. Not as much as you. Who is more likely to run away and join the circus? Did you yeah. say me? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, for sure. I mean, I don't really know what talent I have for the circus. You would be, but uh, you would be like Zendaya. You would be like the beard. With the, the no, stars. you'd be like the bearded woman. The bearded woman. Oh, I'd be the bearded lady. <laughs> yes, but without a beard. So it's just my bodily weirdness. I have no bodily. No, but she's like ah! oh, her, her singing. Yes. Oh, okay. Duh, that how I could get. I don't know. I, I did like, not understand that. I thought you were talking about her beard. I was like, uh, Heck I no. have no beard. I don't have a beard. No, I mean, yeah. I actually, that's a funny story. Did you know that my, so my great aunt, question mark, is like my, my mom's mom's oh brother's ex-wife. Her name was Carmen and she was Hispanic and she was in the circus. She was a um, trapeze artist. That's like really far down the line, but far Fun right. Fact. <laughs> there you go, circus folk. It's not technically in my blood, but I'm related to it. It is. Kind of. I don't even like that song. Ooh, I'm so sorry for all you Shawn Mendes fans. Please don't unsubscribe. <laughs> don't unsubscribe. Um, um, I have this one if you want. Who is more likely to cause a world war? I don't know how I would do it, but I just stick my nose would, in everyone's business. You'd probably say something like, actually, you'd be like Hamilton. Oh, like in a good way? Like start a revolution. But you want a revolution, I want a revelation. So listen to my declaration. We hold these truths to be self-evident that all women are created equal. And when I meet Thomas Jefferson, oh, I'ma compel him to include women in the sequel. Work! Thank you, that was fun. Look around, look around, revolution's happening in New York, New York. Jellico, work! So maybe I won't have a Newsies count, I'll just have a Musicals count. It's like 1500. 15 bajillion million. Do you want to do another one? Sure. This you video is 20 minutes long. I'm sorry, one more. You should okay, I'll pick one. So I'll just go like this. this. And that's at the bottom of the screen. LOL. LOL. LOL, 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 LOL. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. I don't remember how it goes. Wait, that's stupid. Oh, I hate that one. That's stupid too. Uh oh. Okay, who's more likely to move to a different country? Really? Where would you go? I feel like I would end up in Europe. Me too. 
We've both been out of the country before. When did you, where did you go? Italy and Greece and oh, right. Turkey. And Greece, I went to Greece. London, Paris yeah. and then Canada as well. Oh, Canada, that's exciting. But then, oh yeah, but I've been to like so many different islands. That's true, me too though. We went on, we actually, fun fact, went on a cruise like the exact same time, but weren't friends yet. Well. Yeah, we, I was like, wait a minute. Cause I saw all her posts on Instagram cause like I went, go to school with her and I was like, wait, what? This is the, yes, I was, I, I was, was there. I was like, just, I was just there. there. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> whoa. Yeah. We're in San Juan, Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. The funniest thing is when I got back to Hannah had DM'd me and she was like, this is when Hannah and I weren't even friends. She's like, you went to San Juan, that's where my family's from. She's like, oh my gosh, that's so cool. So that's funny because it was like the three of us and then now we're uh, three. Squad. Squad. We're hanging out tonight. I don't know what that was. It was squad. <laughs> it's been a good time. <clears throat> Glad you could join us. Glad you enjoyed it. Glad you could learn a little bit more about I feel like everyone. I'm so much more fun when I have someone here that I can, you know, bounce. Bounce off. Bounce off. <laughs> it's just too hard to just talk to a camera by yourself, I feel like sometimes. And it's easier to be more like yourself and more real when you have a friend. So, you know, pro tip. That's there you go. Pro tip for. Anyway, YouTube. here's your phone, by the way. So, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, then please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel down below if you're not. Also, definitely go check out Eden's channel. She's really super awesome and I love her lots. And, and I love you too. I hope you guys like her. Thank you. I hope you guys <laughs> like her because you're going to be seeing a lot of this beautiful face on my channel. We're going to be doing so much good near stuff. Future. Yes. True. Okay, I will see you guys next Sunday at 8 o'clock. Thank you. What if we made it like a musical thing? Like, um, nah, I can't, I can't think of it. I don't know what she's saying. <laughs>